All right, guys, today we're going to be showing you how to uh, hook up an ender chest to your ME system so you don't have to run cables all over the place in your Sky Factory world from your sieve or other things you want to send to your ME system. So basically, you're going to place down, actually, I need to be in creative for this. There we go. Uh, just because I didn't grab a second chest here. But um, you're going to place down your chest, so wherever you want this, whatever you want to send items into this thing. So let's grab another chest just to say, uh, this should do. Extract, and we want to send the items insert. So whatever is in this chest is going to get pulled into your ender chest. Next, you want to go to your ME system after you hook this up to whatever you want to send into this chest and you're going to place it next to one of your cables wherever they are it doesn't matter where it is but in this case we're going to place it right here and you notice it doesn't connect up so what we need is this uh, ME import bus and that's going to pull items out of this chest into your ME system now you want to shift right click and drop it in there and as you can see it connected right into your cable and then you can click the interface right now it'll take everything it has on it see our ME system's empty so we can just toss that in there and it'll pull them right into the ME system here now if you notice that was a bit slow so if you want to improve the rate at which it pulls items out of this chest you gotta make these acceleration cards right here and personally, I only put two of these in. You can put four, and it'll pull out the items super fast. And also, we can do capacity cards, which expands the number of uh, filtered items, if that's what you want to do. So let's say we want stone, but we don't want cobblestone in here, right? So we're going to take our cobblestone, or we're going to take our stone, and put it right there. Now it's going to filter, start filtering items, and I think this should work, I hope. So it's putting the items in here. We have it filtering stone out, not cobblestone. So if you notice, it's going to start pulling the stone out of the ender chest. And it's leaving the stone in there because we don't want it in our ME system. But let's say we did want it, so we can just click that out. We don't need our capacity cards because we're not filtering anything. So see, it pulled our cobblestone in. And this is a little bit longer than I normally do a video, but that's all right. And that's basically it.